Well, Katie, right now we can tell you that no one is injured as a result of this. I'm going to let you take a look at the scene here as these doors open. You can see through them that crews are working on that United plane. That is the one that was clipped here. You can see from these photos that uh, were taken from aboard one of those planes, one plane was backing up from its gate when it, its wing hit the tail wing of another plane at a neighboring gate. That's the plane you were just looking at live. Now, a United spokesman says they deplaned both both these, these aircraft and are now working to make accommodations for the passengers as each flight has been canceled. One plane was going to Newark and the other was going to Denver. Luckily, no one was hurt here when this happened around 9 o'clock this morning. And again, as you mentioned, this comes after two planes nearly collided here last week when one was landing and the, on, the other one was taking off when it was not supposed to. Again, in both of these cases, uh, no one was injured. As you take a live look back, Back here again, you can see again these crews uh, continuing to work on the damage. Again, those planes, uh, people were taken off those planes. No one was hurt, luckily. We're going to have much, much more in this story. We uh, spoke with a couple of passengers earlier. They say that they felt the shaking of the impact. We'll hear from them coming up at 4 o'clock. For now, we're live at Logan Airport. I'm Peter Iliopoulos, WCBB News Center 5.